Hello everyone, my name is Chris Stevens, CEO and Managing Partner with KW Philadelphia. Alongside me is Paul Fontaine. Hey Paul. Hey there. How are you? Doing well, how are you? Good, thanks for joining me today. Thanks for having me. Awesome, so we're, we're in our Society Hill location, which yes. is where your office is. Yeah. Um, I want to start off with, tell everyone about yourself, what areas you focus on in real estate, and what you're looking forward to in 2020. Sure. Uh, my name is Paul Fontaine. I've been in real estate for 17 years. I was at Berkshire Hathaway for 13 years, and I moved over to Keller Williams four years ago, and I'm very happy here. I'm in Queen Village where I live, so I specialize mostly in Center City and Queen Village, South Philly area. Awesome. Um, for 2020, I mean, 2019 is obviously long gone. Sure. We're already into the spring market, even though we're in February. What are you focusing on in 2020? My YouTube channel. Uh, I decided to focus on YouTube in 2020. Uh, I have around eight videos right now. I'm putting out one per week. And really just specializing in letting people know about what they should be doing as a buyer, what they should be doing as a seller, mm -hmm. uh, some top tips. And uh, it's really been worthwhile and I've got a lot of great feedback from, from people that are watching. That's awesome. How do people uh, get into your YouTube channel? Yeah, it's uh, youtube.com backslash the letter C and then backslash Paul Fontaine Realtor. Fantastic. What's one tip you can give our audience out there for buyers or sellers to look out for when they're looking to list their house or to go buy a house? Uh, for sellers, probably the number one thing as a seller is to price the property correctly. Mm -hmm. I would say 80% of selling is, is pricing it correctly. You can talk about all the marketing you want and doing sure. drones and things like that, uh, but if it's not priced correctly, it's not going to sell. So price it correctly and then we can talk about marketing after that. Uh, in terms of buyers, I would say touch base as early as possible with a mortgage company to get pre-approved. You know, mortgage lenders are just like us. They're here to advise you, give you information, uh, and it's for free. You don't have to use them uh, after you put a purchase under agreement. Mm -hmm. um, and they can help you with your credit score because pretty much you're locking down your credit score and your interest rate for 30 years. So the better your credit score, the better your interest rate is. Uh, and so might as well do it now before you, you know, put an offer for a house. That's fantastic. What parts of Philly are really hot right now? Um, if someone's looking to you know, invest or buy in Philadelphia, what would you recommend? Uh, Plank Breeze has been hot. It's a little overpriced right now. I have always thought Grace Ferry, which is the next neighborhood over from Plank Breeze. Yeah. Um, so it's pretty much west of 25th Street. It's very close to Penn, and anytime you're close to a very large employer, it's, yeah. great, it's great at, you know, for the value of the property. So I would say Grace Ferry. Um, and then also anywhere near, near, near Temple, anywhere near Broad Street, they're expanding their horizons. So the, the brewery towns and the Francisvilles, um, and then also just north of that. Pretty much what you want to do is just look at what's the hottest neighborhood and then just go one neighborhood past that. Sure. Uh, because that's in general how, how development works. It starts in Center City and goes south and goes north and it keeps expanding. Yeah, that's great. L last thing, why should people hire you? Uh, I would say I've been doing this for 17 years and it, it's kind of a standard answer, but my 17 years of experience, mm -hmm. In 17 years, I've probably seen every problem possible, and so I, in general, have a, a good idea of how to resolve things, and that only comes with experience, for sure. Um, and then also, I'm, I'm told each and every day by clients that my customer service is amazing. Uh, I, I just got a, a remark from someone yesterday saying, thank you so much for getting back to me so quickly. Uh, someone said two days ago, thank you for following up. You know, I appreciate your, your, your follow-up on all this. So. As soon as someone contacts me, I contact, you know, contact them back. Um, and I think the expediency of it all, uh, and just in general, being on top of things is really something that yeah. I'm thankful for. You're a true professional. Thank you. Really good at what you do, and it's an honor to have you on our brokerage. I mean that. Um, how can people get a, in, in contact with you? Uh, my, my logo is Call Paul, so you can always give me a call at 215-917-2276. Uh, my, my email address is paul at bestphillyhomes.com or check out my website at bestphillyhomes.com. Thanks. Fantastic. See you everyone until next time. See you later. Thanks, Paul. Thanks. You okay. got it?